Okay, so what we're going to do is just go through a few, uh, few uh, function, um, a few setup steps here on the uh, Kenwood 710. So we hit the uh, F key, push it in here. We're going to go to APRS menu, and um, we're going to go to the bottom of the list just to get us going. So you, first, you want to put your call sign in. Just take the defaults on uh, menu 601. Uh, the GPS port, uh, change this to 9600. Uh, that's what we like to use with the AVMAP. Uh, input, you want to select uh, GPS. If you've got a weather station, you can select, uh, select Pete Brothers. Uh, waypoint, you want to uh, select Waypoint. Go back, go to the next menu. Now this is real important with the uh, AVMAP. Make sure you use a Kenwood format. There are several others, NEMA, but because of the Kenwood string, uh, you only get two icons with a NEMA. So what you want to do is make sure you have the Kenwood format uh, waypoint. Uh, the name is nine characters, and for right now, I'll put all. All these others, I just take the defaults. I do like to change uh, status text to number five. And what that does is it will broadcast uh, the tune feature on the 710 so that people could see what frequency that, uh, that you're on. And I'll show you, give you a demonstration of that in just a second. I use a Kenwood icon. Um, the default method is manual. I put smart beaconing on and just to, because it seems to work real good. And I turn voice alert on. And basically all the other ones, just, just to get started, those are just the basic ones you have to remember. Again, your call sign, take the defaults on 601, 602, make sure you got 9600 GPS, uh, waypoint, 9600 BPS, G GPS on the input, output is waypoint. And on your waypoint format, you want it Kenwood, nine characters, output all. Basically, status text, 608, you want on five. And turn voice alert on, unless you want to hear beacons for all your life. For your YLs, frame of mind, turn voice alert on so you won't get all that noise. And basically, that's it. So this tune this tune feature, uh, I'm going to have my buddy Kevin, he's going to go in here and he's going to send me a, a, a beacon. Okay. There's Kevin right there, KI4LAX, and there's a t tune uh, status. He's put his frequency in, uh, what well, they call it, QSY, um, QSY. So by going down to Kevin, selecting it, and tuning it, it actually puts it in the frequency and even the tone that he's on. Hey, Kevin, go to, go, to, uh, go to 440. So back to the list. I'll just bring up Kevin so we can see him. There is frequencies 444875. By having him selected and hit tune when I escape the radio QSYs. And that's a great thing about this aspect of APRS. It's not just tracking, but it's status of stations. It's uh, things that are going on. So that's it.